Happy Thursday, everyone. This is a pick a card reading for December 10th, Thursday. You pick a card that is your main energy, but I do pull it all together. Energies for all of us. And December 10th, birthdays, we'll do your reading next. If you pick card number one for December 10th, Thursday, you have the six of wands. Nice. Okay. This, to me, is victory. I pick it up right away. So it is victory, okay? Um, I do see there's um, a message of help, a message of love, maybe dealing with a child for some of you is what I'm feeling or someone younger than you. There's offers of assistance here. So you have good energy, um, connecting with people, talking with people who you usually don't. I don't know. There's a lot of that energy. Um, there are people who are committed and um, loving to you today, too. So I feel that whether it's work anywhere, I feel a wish is going to come to fulfillment. So I overall feel a very good energy here. OK, so this is um, good. I have to say that's all I'm going to say. If you pick card number two, Major Arcana, Temperance. Um, what I'm feeling here is don't bite off more than you can chew. Okay, you could be multitasking again today, taking on a lot, trying to get things done. There's a sense of moving, moving adjustments, um, you know what I mean, kind of struggles. Um, try to stay as calm as you can. I feel this is patience, doing things differently, creative touches. All of that's going to be um, helpful. I feel there's a lot of movement today, so it's like moving, doing things, uh, shuffling things around. Um, good news is going to come through. OK, I just I, I do feel that in energy, too. There is a celebratory energy here, too. But do everything in moderation and do things a little differently. This could be even some movement. These could be quick uh, trips or for some of you planning some kind of a trip. OK, but that just some adjustments that need to be made. OK, if you pick card number three for December 10th, Thursday, you have the Empress to major arcanas here. I feel the Empress is going to be very important for you today in this way, is taking a leap of faith. There's an adventurous energy here, too. You're feeling better. Maybe you haven't been feeling well. I don't know what it is, but there's something that you're feeling better about. This is a time to kind of have more fun, uh, get the rest that you need. Um, just, I want to say slow things down a little, okay? It's like you're working towards your abundance, of course, feeling great. Um, maybe you want to take some kind of a risk, but... No quick, quick decisions. Um, be focused. There's a sense of your little bit, um, your focus isn't just um, it, to par today. So kind of slow things down. Get the rest that you need because, or, yeah, you could be accident prone. I mean, there's something like that because you're not focusing. The thing is, I feel some big changes are coming in. You may not know it yet. So um, slow down making some kind of plans or you're thinking of things on one direction, but then things may change. There are big changes that are coming up as well. This is what I'm feeling here, but it's a really good card too, okay? Could be a focus on a female today, mother or mother figure as well. So there is that energy. When we pull it together, we have the six of um, wands. We have temperance and the empress. Remember, these trump the readings. These are major arcanas here. So there are big changes that are coming through. There is a focus on our planting roots today. Stability, good news with home, with love. Um, I feel there's some good energy. There's some adjustments that are being made. Um, you just have to stay positive. I feel some of you just uh, got these negative thoughts. You know, things are going well, but then you got these negative thoughts that are running through your head. Um, there will be, I feel, a sudden change, okay? So um, kind of make a plan A, B, or C. There's a sense of sudden changes could occur too, okay? So follow your intuition, things that maybe are, no, are not known yet. Um, sudden changes, kind of watch the temper. I want to say here, we're kind of setting our ways. Uh, we want things done, but the, it, it's a sudden change that I'm feeling, okay? So kind of... Expect that, but there's breakthroughs here. Um, I do feel also maybe dealing with a cancer energy is present today too, or someone who exhibits those energies. Overall, that sudden change I feel is going to bring us abundant. There's abundant energy and luck on our side here too. Okay. Well, I hope you have a wonderful Thursday. And now for December 10th, babies, a happy birthday if you're born today, December 10th, or if you know someone. This is a quick reading, a solar theme, and your wish card. I do offer all kinds of readings, uh, birthday readings um, on my website under solar year. People ask me that all the time. Um, even something similar to this. But 
this is a very general reading. Okay, so let's get to it. All right, so the solar year theme, and remember it's a general reading, is the Seven of Swords. This is a year of rethinking, eliminations, um, watch your stuff. There could be something or somewhat a significant event because, you know, during the solar year, we do have ups and downs, but this card will indicate, um, there are liars around you. There is deception around you. Someone who wants to steal from you. There is something there. At least some point during the solar year, you're going to have to be very careful. There's a significant either theft or plagiarism or someone's watching you too carefully. Get information too. It's like doing your research is going to be important this year. You could be very business focused or focused on um, something as well. Um, I do feel there is going to be um, major transformations in your solar year, a significant death and a rebirth. Okay, so there's transformation, ending, something's gone, it's ending, so um, there could be some a, a series of endings and transformation during this solar year. When it comes to your work and career or school, I do feel that do not assume anything. Get the information you need, okay? Um, yes, be warned of uh, people trying to steal your ideas or uh, plagiarism. At the same time, this could be sneaky going both ways, okay? And if you do, just say you're stealing anybody's ideas and that you're going to get caught. Uh, so play things the right way. Uh, um, you know what I mean? So that's, uh, well, it's up to you. It's your life. But I see it both ways here too, Okay. Um, I do see there could be some life-altering change or a major decision that's going to be made with a job, work, career, something like that, okay? When it comes to your finances, definitely watch the money this year. There are There is theft around. Make sure, and that's this big amount of money. So make sure that someone's not trying to steal something. Um, make sure that, or identity theft. I'm not saying it's for everyone, but there is a warning um, this can even be inheritance or something, having a struggle, someone trying to kick you out of a will, uh, property matters, whatever you're dealing with, a big significant amount of money, make sure you get all the information, read the disclaimers, there can be some deception or something unknown here, okay? Um, you know, don't you don't want any surprises with finances, okay? For others, doing your work, your research is going to bring you rewards, this could be a major promotion, but there may be people who are going to try to fight and try to um, throw you under the bus. So there is that warning. But with with um, knowledge, um, information, research, you got it. Okay. When it comes to relationships, if you're single, you will be spoiled for choice. Um, I do see having fun, but everything in moderation. It's a, it's like a lot of fun when it comes to dating. Uh, relationships, a wish is going to be fulfilled there too. When it, it, If you're already in a relationship, um, there is a sense of a lot of fun and yes, um, wishes coming through uh, happy times, but everything in moderation is I'm picking up in um, when it comes to relationships. All relationships, I feel that yes, there's happy times just enjoying yourself. This is like... Um, uh, getting get togethers, uh, dinner parties, um, just fun, loving energy. There's a significant yes and a wish fulfillment when it comes to all relationships this year as well. Okay. So that's looking good. Now your, um, wish for your solar year is the page of wands. All right. So what I'm feeling here for some of you, um, this is, You've got, yes, the wish will come to fulfillment, but I feel it's only partial or there's a beginning and there's another ending. There's something that's still hidden there, okay? There's delays uh, for others. It's, it's, it's like, yes, but it's, it's going to come in a twist of fate with conflict and delays, okay? Or you hear something about it. Can't be dealing with someone younger or something. Message may be important. Um, I want you to make your intentions very clear. If your intention is not clear, because it's almost telling me it's the universe is hearing just uh, the beginning of this, your intentions need to be clear. Otherwise, it's going to be a no. So you make your intentions very clear, okay? And keep things more discreet because there is a sense of deception around as well. You don't want people who are jealous or to steal anything from you. You know what I mean? But yes, twist of fate uh, with some delays and conflicts. For some, yes, it's it's partial fulfillment, but make your intentions clear is so importantly coming through here. 
The important numbers for your solar year is 10, 1, um, 9, 6, and 7. I hope you have a wonderful birthday today and a wonderful solar year. And for everyone else, a wonderful um, Thursday and bye for now.